Hey guys, so I just wanted to give a quick tutorial on how to make a Tekkit server. So, uh, first thing you want to do is go to the Technic Pack, uh, technicpack.net, and download a 3.0.4 server. Uh, then you want to go pull it, in, create a new folder, call it whatever you want. I just made a YouTube tutorial. Um, I already made a server, so this is my server I'm running right now. Uh, so, once you download that, create a new folder, pull the thing, pull the dot zip that you got into that folder that you just made and then you should be good and then you're gonna open it with archive utility and then you should get a folder you're gonna open it and as you can see there's uh, all this stuff so we're just gonna let's see let's pull this out here delete this you can delete that just open this uh, and you get all this stuff. So now you want to make a. So what do you want to see? So you're gonna search in your Minecraft wiki dot net. You're gonna search uh, server tutorial. I'm pretty sure that should be it. If not, alright. Okay, tutorial setting up a server. Yeah, that should be it. Um, so you're gonna go into it. And you're gonna scroll down to the Mac version, I believe. Because where this is gonna be the Mac tutorial. So yes, Mac OS X instructions. You're gonna copy and paste this into you're gonna go to your search bar up here, you're gonna do text oops, text edit, open it, copy paste it in and then this part right here uh, you're gonna do one or two so I'm just gonna put mine on two to change these numbers to two or just keep them at one so that should be good except now you have to do change this because this is what it's gonna be the file that it's gonna be running it on so we want it to be running on TechIt so we have to do cop we have to delete the Minecraft server delete that and write TechIt uh, or it won't work. So you're gonna save. Oh, you're gonna do format. Uh, make plain text. You're gonna do OK, and then you're gonna do file, save. Uh, you're gonna do st start. You can name it start dot command. Save it. Okay, it's right here. So pull it in here. And then this is where you're gonna need to do terminal. So if you don't already have terminal op terminal open, uh, do go in the search bar and search terminal, and it should be right there. Uh, so just open that. Go in here. You have to type in chmod space a plus x space. Remember the space. The space is important. And then you pull this thing right in here. Press enter, and that sh you should be good. Uh, so usually I make this colored. So just do that. Okay, so now you're just gonna launch it and you're gonna let it load. So usually it has to load all the mods first, so hopefully, yeah, all the mods are loaded. So you have to stop the server once that's complete. Uh, I'm pr you have to delete advanced machines, so then it should be good. Now you're gonna run it again. And, oh yeah. Advanced machines, I think it's what else? I remember those specific okay, remove EE server mod I see you okay. uh and I think nether ores has to be deleted and think that should be good. So you're gonna run it. And it's gonna load all the mods. It can create a new world, all that good stuff. And uh let's see continue, continue. Okay, so I think this is gonna be a good time to uh once you have that done. Uh open Hamachi. If you don't already ha go have that, go to, go to Hamachi and get the free version. Uh, this will show up. 
So you want to create a new one. You're going to do network, create new network, call it whatever you want, put in a password. Uh, tell your friends to join by going to network, join existing network, and enter what you just did. Uh, so we should be good here. So it, when it says done, right here, whatever that says, uh, you should be good. Um, so then you're going to go launch your check it launcher or what else, whatever else you have. Uh, and then open it and you want to enter this IP. You want to go over here, this IP right here, 5.229.225.16. No, if there's a slash and whatever behind there, it doesn't really matter. So don't use that. Uh, I just use the 5.229.225.16. Well, yours is going to be different, but this is the one that I'm using. Uh, this is the one that that's my IP. So let's do this. So then you're going to go into your folder and you're going to go here. And right over here is going to be your server.properties, uh, right here. So you're going to open with text edit and server IP, put the whatever right here was in, whatever 5.229.25.16. Yep, put that in. And then you're going to open up here. And it should be up. It should be 5.229.225.16 or, or whatever your log me and Hamachi is, IP is. So as you can see when we go on, It works. Uh, so I already have a world. So me and my friend have been working on this world. So uh, this is pretty much it. This is how you make a ticket server. And I can prove to you that it's a ticket server. That because it that works because okay. So I'm up now. So we can. Options to move open this up. Give myself a new or I'll give myself creative actually. Okay, so let's see, it's fun. See and it works. Usually, if you 